we're back at it. Uh, I've been sandblasting my tail off, and I got a little bit more to do on this. And then I did a thing. So hopefully you guys like it. Mock this up. Get the motor trans in it. Get the brakes on it. Finish the sandblasting. And then I have a surprise for you. You're going to have to wait for the motor. Let's get started. Okay, so I only have a little bit left. Um, this is definitely tricky. This is tricky, but it's I'm, it's got the look I'm going for. I wanted to make it look like it's been sandblasted. Some spots don't work. Some do. Like the door jams are kind of hard. But the box, I mean. It takes a minute. But I'm almost out of sand too, so. Guess I'll go until I run out. But at least you guys get an idea of what it what it actually does if you're new to the game. Yeah, we're out. Okay, there's that. Alright, now we gotta go switch up some primer. Um That's gonna be a video all by itself, but I'm gonna be building that for a guy. on Bunkle's Discord, so Alright, so I need just a plain old Jane o gray. Let's Looks good enough. Okay, I grab the gun. Let's go get this stuff primed up so it does not rust. Yeah, I cannot wait to get this thing painted up, back together. Yeah, it's close enough. Close enough to primer. Uh, if I can hold on to the gun. I wish they had some, like, something you can hang these parts on. That'd be pretty cool. But, hopefully this is, uh, turns out pretty good. It is definitely taking me a while to sandblast this cap. But I like it because it gets rid of the dirt, gets rid of the paint. Yeah, I could have just washed it, but... I'm trying to go realistic here and just do it right. Nothing better than a brand new paint job. And then I go wreck the truck, right? Alright, now I gotta fly up here a little bit. To paint the roof. Yeah, that's that. Alright, let's do this. I forgot the trim there. Yeah, I was going to record doing that frame, but that, that was time consuming. Running back and forth. Talk about money though. Holy moly. This stuff, the, the chroming stuff is expensive. But I want to get everything buttoned up on the truck and then we'll put the body on it I can't wait to show you the motor oh missed something right there 
I believe that's dirt. Find out if it's dirt or not. It is. Whoa, 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 whoa. It grabs a bed. Okay. Get on it. So you gotta kind of click off of the bed. All right. I think all is good. Uh, to replace the floor pan in the cab, you have to disassemble the whole thing. So, oh, well, let's put this up here real quick. I gotta put the rockers on this. Touch these up to make a match. Apparently, I bought the same rocker twice. Is got it. Okay, grab the welder. These tacked in. Double check, make sure I didn't forget any welds. Okay, yeah, set that there. What do I do with the gun? Prime these rockers up. Alrighty, so I guess we could throw the cab on it for mock up because I have to run the brake lines and stuff. So, all that that does look pretty sick. I was wondering how this was going to look with that body on it. Now I did leave the axles black or the diffs black because I want I don't want it all chrome. I want something that's pretty sweet. Now I'm, I'm going to put all this together for mock-up and just, you know, for you guys to look at. Let's put the transmission in it. There. All right, let's go grab this motor. Look down so you guys can't see it. And run into the table. There she is. We're going blown. I mean, it's not going to push as much horsepower as like twin turbo, but tell me that don't look sweet. So I've been uh, working my tail off. Something cool. You guys say you love the builds, so. I'm going to keep them coming like this. Okay, let's get these parts on this truck. Because I'm tired of tripping over them. I don't know where half the parts are gone. Because I'm kicking them everywhere. Set that there. Need the screwdriver. Alright. 
get the front end buttoned up caliper nope let's there we go and that's this side Okay, I need two brake lines. There. Run that. Alright, I'm gonna put these in the backpack. This has gotta go on the rear end. Real curious about these brake shoes. I haven't done those yet, so. Where is it? Oh, it's way up there. Okay, can we put these in the backpack? Cannot, so that's going to suck. Oh, I guess I just... Clip on there, okay. Pretty cool. Drum brakes. Okay, those are. You still gotta screw those on. Just like the rotor. I wanted to paint these, but. They're not paintable. So. Definitely can't wait until they do a. Uh, frame painting on these trucks. Because you're going to see a lot of sick builds coming out. Alright, let's get the flavor of tire that's going to go on this. I don't know if I'm going to go with these yet or not. We'll see how they look. I don't know, man. I'm, uh, I might go with the other rims at the, uh, uh, the beach, because these I don't think they're big enough. So tires and rims subject to change. Oh, they might grow on me. I was trying to build it like a SEMA truck type deal. Who knows, after I get it painted, it might look pretty cool, it might not. I, I don't know. Okay. So, I'm going to work on getting everything buttoned up before I put the front clip on it. Then I thought about, like, a mud bogger. I mean, it's kind of where I'm going right now. I mean, that in the front end of the truck. Uh, I'm real curious to see if the hood fits. This can go on. I can still plumb everything else. Does fit. Sweet. How much room do we got? Oh, we have plenty of room. So these are. This is going to be the raised up hood that bumps up just a little bit. That's going to work out great. Okay. So we need a fuel line. Uh, we'll just go with Chad. V8 engine. 
Okay, let's get the core support on. I don't think this is bent. I hope not. Okay, so now we gotta go... You know we gotta make it look snazzy. You know, I could probably drop this down on the ground and be a little easier to get to everything. I don't know, that, that is looking pretty cool. I thought it was going to be more squished than that, but I'm kind of liking that. Okay, so now we need upper radiator hoses. Oh, I know why. So I don't have this guy right here. So I'm going to put this on for now. I have to get it chromed or get a paintable one. Oh, I might leave it. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. I'm hooked on the truck. There's no parking brake. It was a bad idea to move this thing off the lift. Don't want to dent it. Stop that. There we go. Okay. Alright, so that's that, that, that. Need a starter. I don't know what exhaust to do for this thing yet. Okay. Yeah, I believe that's everything for that. Now I have the master cylinder here. Apparently it goes empty when you take it off. Okay, pedals. It's got to have some in here. There it is. Right. Oh, I got it. There it is. Okay. Wonder what they're doing for the steering column. Nope, I don't have to go. I might have to go to the junkyard and get one. Okay, so we're gonna have to go get a steering column because I threw the other one away. Okay, this is the B200. I don't have a transmission for that. Wafer transmission. And then I need a parking brake, which Guess any park and break work, they're all the same. Oh, it's under brakes. Got it. 
Wow, I need to wake up. Okay, so we install this, now it won't roll away. There we go. Okay, so now we're gonna, we're gonna put all this stuff on it. And that's the reason right there. I don't like building on a lip. Because you can't get to anything. Actually, what I can do now. Grab this. I mean, the truck's tall enough I can fit under it. Uh, I need two inner fenders. It's that and that. I have no clue where my wrench just went. There it is. Found it. Okay, fenders. Whoa. Now, I don't know what bumper to put on. I don't know if I should go factory. Um... I'll let you guys decide that one. So the bumpers, obviously, like wrecker style. Got um, bumper like uh, this. And uh, I, to me, I think it's too wide. It just doesn't look right. And they got the regular. See, this is, they're all too big. Way too big. Even this is too big. Well, I guess it's too bad, but this right here, that tells me right there, hopefully they make a wrecker. So, should we just go standard bumper? Yep. 
Guess I'll put the standard on until somebody. You guys give me options, I guess. I lost my wrench. There we go. have different grills down here but I think they're for the flat yeah they are so I'm gonna have to go with old trusty dusty here all right I'm only tighten the top one okay there's only one Kind of a sleeper, but I don't know. Oh, we gotta do the tailgate too. I like. I'm gonna say. Yeah, let's grab a wrench, tailgate on it. That's what I was looking for. Well, let's trim off for now. Always catch that door. Every time. Look at that. That looks like dirt. It's either dirt or shadow. That's dirt. Should have washed it. Okay. Look pretty cool. I think different color would help, but we find my decals. We could do lightning. You like the Ford Lightning truck?
Ran out of decals. Have you met Ray? You know, the junk. I don't know why that showed up. Okay, flip it. Net up. Kind of try to wrap it around. See, I don't know. Um. Oh, I painted my blower. Oh well. Okay, so this is going to be put there. Yeah, we gotta move way over here. If anything in this path, it's gonna, it's gonna get it. So. Make this kind of line up. Close enough. Close enough for me. It's a little bit off, but whatever. You get the idea. So, I don't know. You let me know what you guys think of it. I mean, it is what it is. I want to go bigger. I definitely want to go bigger tires. Let's go for a trip. So, I put the pink top around that. Okay. Blow them up if you got them. So. You guys forgot forgot to remind me to put an automatic or uh, manual in this boat. like a dump truck. Perfect. Turn. These bad boys right here. Now we gotta go over here. Alright, so I want the ones that are not 
Jeez. Hopefully it all fits. Stop falling out. One last room. There you go. Now, if I can get out of here without wrecking. This truck is handy to have. machine over here. I have a mess to clean up. I don't know how much bigger they are. I just want to see. And I want you guys' input. I've ran these tires before. Those are a lot bigger. I think that fits the build a little bit better. Paint them black or something. I just let the hair out of the hair. I did. Uh, you let me know which one looks better. I think those look better. 
That's a big old motor in it. But, all right, that's going to do it for this video. Thank you guys for watching. Hopefully you guys enjoyed it. Let me know if you did, and I'll see you in the next one.